Diffusion Pharmaceuticals. I like the ticker. Diffin. You're using an unneeded F. TSC causes dose dependent increase. I guess I guess TSC is one of their is one of their trial products. Um develops novel therapies and enhances the body's ability to deliver oxygen. Its lead product candidate is trans yeah, TSC. That's what they were talking about. Trans solution, crotema malobolate, whatever that is. That is developed to enhance the diffusion of oxygen to tissues as well as to treat COVID nineteen disease. Really interesting. Okay, very I'm surprised how actively traded this is actually not uh, more more active volume than than inactive volume Wow okay wow whoa yikes uh yeah th yeah this is some trash. This is some trash. It always amazes me when I look at a company whose shares are, are like this. You know, a dollar, sub dollar. And I look at their history and see that they were trading in the past at an equivalent of several thousand dollars. In this case, $38,000. That is completely ridiculous. You know what that means? That means someone at some point in time paid the equivalent of the current day number of shares, paid a price per share of $38,000. The poor sod. Poor fella. Poor lady. Ladies can be, t ladies can be terrible traders too. Um... Reports positive trend. Yeah, okay, I'll see it. I'll see it. I'll see it when I believe it. I kind of, I kind of already know that I want to give this a sell unless they can see because companies like this, you know, when you have a chart like this, I've never seen a chart like this that had a history like this, that where where the story ends up good. It just doesn't. It just doesn't. It looks like it, it looks like it looks like it has not broken two dollars since 2018 and it wasn't a downtrend at that point so you can't say like oh it spiked to two dollars and then came back down to its normal levels no it was on the way down with never two dollars before that and then I just uh, I just I, I just can't with a, I just can't with a chart like this there's encouraging effects on ox on, on Oxygenation. Okay, I'll believe I'll, I'll believe that can have impact on the company when I see it. Life sciences companies investor presentations now available. Um, remind stockholders to vote shares. What are they voting for? Hedge funds in wait and see mode. Or it's final results from the phase. I, I don't know. I kind of. I don't really have. An, I don't really have energy to look through all of these stupid results articles. That they're not going. They're not going to amount to anything. I'm pretty sure they're. I'm pretty sure they're not. And if they do, good for them. In fact, you know what? No, I'm not going to give this a sell. I'm going to give this a hold. Because if people honestly think this company can make something of themselves, and more power to them, but. I, I don't think it, it, it can fall any further. But then again, someone probably could have made that argument back in 2018, back in 2019. Well, actually, you know what? No. No, they couldn't have because it was very obviously on the downtrend. It has been at these le it has been hanging around at these levels since at least for the last two years. So it has a has a fairly steady base 
that it has proved that it is capable of holding. So if there's someone out there who has shares and believes in the products and what this company is trying to do and thinks that they can be the next big thing in the future, more power to you. More power to you. It's not my thing, but more power to you. And um, for you, just for you, just for uh, that, that, that one person or more than one person, I don't know. Just for that person out there, I'm willing to give this a hold. So tally-ho with your shares. Have fun, bud. Have fun.